Things you wouldn't hear at a school assembly. Okay, today we're going to have a special outing. So, Miss Williams, if you'd like to tell everybody why you're a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> we welcome a new member of staff today. He has no arms and no legs and no body, and we will call him the head. <laughs> Would whoever's milkshake is bringing all the boys to the yard, please stop it. <laughs> I'm sorry to keep you waiting, boys and girls. I've just had a shit the size of a baby seal. <laughs> <laughs> if you are found in possession of cocaine, you will be given a hundred lines. No, wait. And today in the after school club, uh, we're going to be using paper mache to make a mother that actually loves you enough to pick you up at three o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> I'm delighted to say that during the summer holidays, Mr. Wang married Miss Kerr. <laughs> <laughs> His nickname will remain the same. <laughs> A wise man once said, boys and girls, that if you try your hardest, you can fulfil your dreams. Generally, that's true. Not for you, though, Tom. You can't read. So... <laughs> <laughs> and today, everyone, we have a new boy. Now, for some reason, whatever reason, he's been to a lot of schools. So be kind to him. Will you please make your way to the front? Richard Poo Willy. <laughs> A word about registers. Uh, most of the staff are on one. <laughs> so that is how you put on a condom. <laughs> but, sir, shouldn't you have used a cucumber? <laughs> Not with that E. coli kicking around. <laughs> Sorry, sorry I'm late. I just had a bit of a run-in with an interactive whiteboard. <laughs> it told me to fuck off. <laughs> I've had all your mums. 